Hello everyone, welcome back to Dark Souls 2. You know, I really don't know exactly where the end of the game is, but I've got to be getting really close. Ah, <sighs> which makes me sad. But, in case you don't know, you probably do, but in case you don't, they did just announce uh, a series of DLCs, I think three of them. The first one of which is going to come out next month. So, even after I finish the game, there is going to be more Dark Souls very soon. So there's always that. Liar. Of course, somebody's saying this was an illusory, illusory wall. And of course, it's not. Poor soul. Ahead, by the way, try key. Well, in this case, they mean... Is it technically a key? Oh yeah, it is technically a key. Ashen Mist Heart. It's a very unconventionally shaped key. It's an orb of spirit energy or something. But, uh, anyway, yeah, how many souls of the giants were there? Four or five, and I have two, right? I really don't remember where the hell I got the other one from. It's really strange. Where did it come from? I don't remember. Anyway. Let's go inside. Jai. Be wary of giant. <laughs> no kidding. Visions of fatigue. Obviously, I'm not going to actually complete the memory this time. That's fine. Try head. Oh, wait a minute. Is this right past the one I already got? No, it's not, actually. That's not. I was thinking, like, the previous memory was when I got the uh, soul from this guy, but no, it's not. What's out there is a different battlefield than I saw before. See if I can remember how to play. Oh god, there's a mist. Is this like a boss? Oh no, it's not good. Composure required ahead! What the hell? Good luck. Explosions. Um, poke a little... Ow. Poke a little bit harder. Keep poking. I can't take this. Bonfire aesthetic. Just what I needed to get me through this. Oh, what the fuck? Come on. Where's that even coming from? Oh my god. Oh, that's actually an enemy. Apparently. Oh, god. Uh... Interesting. Hi. Uh, do you mind if I just scoot on uh, pa past you? Excuse me. <clears throat> Excuse me. Excuse me, sir. Sir? 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 This is kind of awkward. Get the fuck out of the way! Jesus. Oh my. It appears to be a king of some sort. Perhaps I can get them in the in the explosion if I track them over here. Let's go get them. Giant lord. Oh god. Oh god. What the? I don't even know where that came from. Hmm. Maybe I should just stay over there. Well, the nice thing about the giants is that they're very slow. That sword attack he did look very easy to dodge. I'll be around. If...
Okay, let's wait for the explosions. Where did that gigantic head even come from? Wait, how do I make it come again? Uh-oh. Oh god. Oh, I thought they are attacking again. Oh shit. Oh, and there's the head. Where did it come from? Must be some sort of gigantic statue. Somewhere. Oh, okay. yeah, there's a statue. Wait a minute. I've been around here, haven't I? Yeah, this is this place, but at a different time. I remember... Well, I mean, I remember some sort of a large sword and a statue. I'm assuming it was that one. Okay, let's observe the patterns, huh? How many explosions happen here? I thought there's just the one. Yeah, just that one right there. It seems that's it. Uh huh. Haha. <laughs> Damn, I'm like invincible when I do that. I have no idea what attack he's doing. Okay. Little stompy stomp. It's probably instant death if I get hit by that, I'm imagining. Doing something with a sword. I have no idea what I can't see. Ow. Wasn't too bad. Giant's kinship, it's a key. And giant lord soul. Hold on, I need to get this. And leave very quickly. Oh shit. Try leg and then hurrah for revenge. Oh, there's the soul of a giant. Here. Oh, what the... Does it just finish automatically? Uh... Hi. Hello, stupid AI. Please fuck off. Thank you. Uh, so yes, I got three... Th what the hell did I get? I got a key. Whoa. Grants access to the throne room beneath castle. The throne room beneath castle. Where I killed the throne guardians, right? But I mean, I can already get inside of there. I'm assuming that, like, makes the bridge open up or something. I don't even know if there was a bridge. Maybe it makes a bridge up here. It allows me to actually get to the throne, because I couldn't get to the throne. I remember there was just a pit. And I think a bunch of, like, giants or something in the pit. I don't know, it was weird. Anyway, I've got three now. I remember somebody told me... Uh, one of my viewers told me about the souls of the giants, and I remember you don't need all of them. 
but I can't remember how many there were. There were either four or five. And given the fact that I now have this key that allows me to get to, the, get to the throne room, I'm thinking that means I've got all I need. But of course, I mean, I want more. I want all the souls. Let's go level up, though. Should get about three levels off of this. Oh, do I have any smooth and silky stones? That loading screen just reminded me of that. I should probably check. Hmm. No, I don't believe I do. I've got so many souls. All of the souls from all of the bosses. I've never used them. One, two, oh. Stupid D-pad. Three. One, two, three. Yeah, three. More stamina. More vitality. Let's go with more adaptability. Some more endurance and some more vigor. How are you doing, by the way? I haven't talked to you for a very long time. Oh, yes, I gave you the farmer's hat or whatever. <laughs> Hello again. How have you been? Pretty good. It's been eventful. You know, I've killed, like, everything. It was a perilous trek I faced them. <laughs> no, nothing new. Oh, increases fire defense. Maybe that's what you're supposed to use for the fiery places. At, uh, the fiery place. I don't remember what it's called. The Iron Keep or whatever. Okay, so... Um, I'm thinking I should go say hello to a certain dragon. Was there another petrified wood giant? I don't know. I'm trying to remember where all of them are. There's a new one I just found. I have a soul from I don't know where, and then I, there's a one that was back at... Forest of Fallen Giants. Was there another one anywhere? It's been so long since I've seen them for the most part. Hmm. Well, regardless, let's go take on the dragon. And there's still the undiscovered part in Aldia's Keep. Where is this bonfire? Gonna drive me nuts. Okay, how do I get to the dragon place? The petrified dragon. I think it's here. Yeah. I remember this is normally the way I take it. Let me see if this new bonfire that I've found since then actually is closer. Hi. Did you really just hurt me? Fuck you. Oh, right, you can't go up there. Yeah, this is probably not an easier... Oh my god, that sounds crazy. I'm getting inside. This is probably not the way to go.
Cannot use bonfire. What? Oh, what? Oh, hi. There we go. God, this is a long run to get all the way to the dragon. I gotta go this way, right? Actually, no, this way's not faster. What am I doing? Or is it? God damn it, I can't remember now. Again. Alright, can everybody just calm the fuck down? Apparently not. I hate you invading AI. I should have backed up. I knew they were going to drop down. I just didn't really care. Yeah, something tells me this uh, dragon's soul going into it, into his memory, is going to be very difficult, which is going to make this run very <laughs> annoying. Because it takes me a good couple minutes to get there. I'll be Yeah, that is the best way to go, actually. Oh, look at those skills! Again. Okay. Come on, you come to me. Oh, wait. Right, you're a mage. Maybe you won't. Fuck. It actually barely hurts. Oh yeah, I don't have my cat ring on. Uh, let's take it slowly. Yeah, it's nice and slow. Actually, wait, they won't, they won't chase me. I just remembered. I mean, well, they will chase me, but they won't come all the way in here. So, I can ignore them. Let's see what's in store for me.
Dragon memories. <laughs> don't give up. I can't. <laughs> don't give up. I can't take this. I'm getting conflicting messages here. I'm assuming that dragon's alive. That's probably the dragon. This place again, like a dream. Everything's like a dream to everybody, it seems like. <laughs> like a dream, like a dream. This place again, like a dream. I have a feeling I might end up hiding behind these rocks to save myself from flames. It's not moving. I'm sure it will. Nice job, Master. Huh? Should hide behind these things. Visions of sadness. Let's check the environment first. Misfortune. Guts ahead. Alright, well, if I hit behind anything, it'd probably be like this. Although I know from past experience that sometimes rocks don't save you from flame. Because flame apparently can travel through rocks. Who knew? Resignation. Boss ahead, therefore be wary of treasure. Poor soul, but think carefully. Two handing ahead. Oh, well, I'm already set then. I guess I'm about to bring it to life. That's it. Oh, no. My time is up. You know, I should probably wait. Yeah, I mean, I've already used up so much time checking out the environment. I don't want the Ashen Mist to just disappear when I'm halfway through the boss fight. So let's just continue to take a look around. Nothing but a bunch of dead ends. Okay, you can take me back now. Come on. You know, I have a feeling the dragon actually might end up moving around. Perhaps that's why this arena is so big. Oh my god, come on. I don't think there's a way to force myself to go back. I think it's you either wait it out, or you win, or you die. Alright, screw it, I'm bored. Oh, I got the ancient dragon soul. I win! Everything's fine, nothing's gonna go wrong, right? Oh, maybe that's actually all I needed to do, but I just pressed it again, and now what? Wait, what? I'm pretty sure you can fight it. Where's its soul? It's not a key, is it? No. It's ancient dragon soul. Oh, there it is. Soul of the great ancient dragon that stands magnificently deep within the shrine. This powerful being stands and waits, 
for whoever may visit it. Use the Dragon Soul, created by those who peered into the essence of the soul, to acquire numerous souls or create something of great worth. What if I go in there again? What if I hit it in the head? Hmm. I thought I had to fight it. Ladder? <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. I thought there was collision on it, so I just kind of ran through it and almost ran off the edge. Oops. I didn't actually mean to do that. So, yeah, this is strange. I thought I could fight it, but... I mean, there's gotta be some way, but I don't know how. Don't think these messages help. Sadness. Visions of gorgeous view. More sadness. Perhaps I hit this. Nope, didn't work. Okay, bye. Okay, am I missing any giant souls? Am I missing any giants? Are there any that I forgot to visit? Alright, so there's the one here. There's the one that's near here. Was there one here? At Soldier's Rest. Go find out. I haven't been there for a long time. That was that dead end spot. I feel like there. Wa I feel like I'm missing one. I'm. In fact, I'm certain I'm missing one. I'm absolutely certain I'm missing one. I remember one in a inside of a room. Yeah, it was inside of a room. Where was that? Unless I already fought it and just don't remember. These are so much easier than they were before. I remember I had so much trouble with them. And now they die in two hits. Aha! Okay. Oh, wait a minute. Can I not go inside your memory? What the? Seed of a tree of giants. Hmm? A giant rests in peace. Oh, so this one doesn't need my help, I guess. Left arm item. Seed of a tree of giants. What do I do with the seed? And where is it? It's not a key, is it?
Obviously only got one of them. So where is it? Trying to find it visually, which is probably a mistake. Of course, I have no idea where it is. Oh, there it is. Enemies react to invaders from other worlds. Makes enemies react to invaders. Oh! When the giants fell, they grew into great trees. Death is not the end, for anything that has ever once lived remains a part of a great cycle of regeneration. But what of those outside of the cycle? Okay, so you need to use that to make the enemies actually go after other enemies, because I... Uh, go after other players, I mean. Because I noticed that there's some times when I don't remember what it is, whether they invade you or you invade them or something. But you end up having to fight the enemies and the player, but they don't actually get attacked by the enemies. It's weird. Okay. So... Is that it? It seems like they're all at the Forest of Fallen Giants. This doesn't make sense, given the name. So I found one here, found one here, found one here. Is there one back here? Let's see what's up here. Oh wait, I think I know where that goes. I don't think there's anything up there. down here. Oh yeah, ambush. Oh, I wanted to backstab you. This is just taking me right back up to here where the other bonfire is. Okay. I can't remember any other giants. I think that might be it. Okay, let's go to the castle. I hope this isn't the end of the game. Please don't be the end of the game. I really don't want it to end.
Wait, why is there mist on here again? Oh. Oh. Um. Hi. I like your skirt. Made of... Made of people. You have proven yourself to me. Nishandra, I don't know who you are, but I guess I'm going to kill you. What does that do? Whoa, whoa, what is that? What is that? Okay, I'm used to that attack. It's fine. Oh, god damn it, it's cursing me. Wow, okay, so everything curses me. Wonderful. Just get used to those attacks. Okay, I'm gonna get cursed. Um, very quickly. So, fuck it. Oh man, my maximum health is going down. I prop. Oh. Whoops. I was gonna say I probably shouldn't walk through that. I also probably shouldn't have walked off the edge. Forgot about the pit. So, despite my ring of life protection, yeah, my max health is fucked. Well, in this case, since I'm gonna have to use... Like, I'm gonna have to use a human effigy after every single fight. Which means my Ring of Life protection might be pretty much useless. I I'm probably gonna have to wear that ring that reduces... Uh, loss of health. Let me check if it actually is gonna work that way, though. I'm not sure if it's going to work for this. I don't know if it works for getting cursed. Let's see if I can remember what it looks like. Hmm. Limits the wearer's HP reduction when hollow. I don't know if that's going to actually reduce this. I don't know if it just reduces it on death or on curse as well. I suppose I should try it. So, yeah, let's use it in place of this. Do I have anything that reduces my... Like, increases my curse resistance? Is there even such a thing as curse resistance? There is. Mine's 145. Alright, let me check my rings. Okay, is there something I can shove in my mouth? Do I have any curse related stuff whatsoever? 
Fire. Dark. Poison. Bleeding. Petrify. I have nothing for fucking curse. Let's check some rings. Hello. Nope. Be safe. I wonder if you just can't increase your curse resistance with equipment. Kitty cat. Flying feline boots. Reduces falling damage. <laughs> oh, I bet those look awesome. In fact, I'm gonna buy them. Alright, what have we got here? Mm-hmm. 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 Okay. Not gonna happen. Alright, that's fine. Okay, those look kind of awesome. <laughs> oh, look at those paws. Oh. Hello. My journey is already complete. My name is Shanalot. The dragon gave me this name, for I was born with none. I was born of dragons, contrived by men, by ones who would cause and fate herself. They are the ones who created me, but they failed. I did not come out as intended. Fate would not be best, and men were cursed once again. If you proceed, Nashandra will come after you. Knowing that you will take the throne and link the fire. She covets the first flame and the great soul. Put Nishandra to rest. I can do that. I'm pretty sure the curses stop at some point. It, it, I mean, I know from dying, I think you can only get down to, uh, at most, 50% of your maximum health. I hope the same applies to curses, otherwise the curses might actually kill me. There's not even any point in healing. Oh, what the? 
Wait, what? What just killed me? I don't even know what just happened. Does getting cursed take away from your health as well as your max health? I, I don't know what just happened. Anyway, I feel like that ring did reduce how much it got hurt from getting cursed. Alright, I can dodge your attacks relatively easily, but the safer play... ...is probably to wait for her to shoot her beam and then run up to her. Because when she does that, she doesn't move very much, and she does it for a very long time. Whereas if I'm super close to her and I get hit by her attacks, it hurts quite a bit. So yeah, even if I'm at 50%, assuming that is the max I can get down to from being cursed, I think the curses might just hurt me anyway. You know what would be really nice in this fight is that mushroom that gradually, constantly restores your HP. Perhaps I will use it. Alright, shoot your beam. You know, wait, maybe I can, like, destroy these things or something. Shit. Oh, man, I thought I went under it, because I know you can dodge him. Okay, I think you can kill these things, apparently. Yep. Come on, shoot your beam. Okay, maybe I should have dodged it. <laughs> oh my god, okay, well. Yeah, I'm getting uh, a picture of what to do in this fight. I'm still learning the reads, the, the tells on her attacks. I kind of thought she was going to resummon all those things around. Nope, she was shooting the beam at my face. I should have dodged anyway. Um. Yeah, I guess I'll use a human effigy. What the hell else am I going to do with my. with my, what, like 20? 18? You think at this point the door would just be like, okay, yeah, I know who you are, you can stop digging around in your inventory, I'll just open for you. Come on in. Stupid door. When did I get hurt? Must have been when I jumped or something. Or perhaps I stepped on a nail.
Oh, no, you don't. Yes, you do. Is that really supposed to hit me? Come on, do your beam. Oh, wait, wait, oh, she's resummoning her shit. Damn it. Do your beam. Okay. Shit. Come on, do your beam. I'm gonna preemptively do this. Okay, I almost got her. Just don't fall off an edge. Beam, do the beam. Okay. Yeah, that wasn't too hard. That was pretty easy, actually. A bit time-consuming, but not too bad. <laughs> that was not worth like 100,000 souls, but okay. Yeah, the freaking Dark Lurker fight gives you like 30,000. This one gives you like 100. Weird. <sighs> Heart's still racing, though. Praise the sun. Hurrah for life. Pointless. Hmm? Oh. flourish anew, and all of this will play out again. It is your choice. 
to embrace or renounce this. Great Sovereign, take your throne. What lies ahead, only you can see. Oh no, I did finish the game. Damn it. <laughs> okay, well I definitely missed at least one fight. I mean, I missed a bonfire. Somewhere. And I'm pretty sure you can fight that dragon. Somehow. I don't know how. And I wonder how New Game Plus works and all of that. I don't know. <sighs> anyway, now I'm sad. I finished the game. I didn't really want to. But only because I didn't want it to end, not because it was bad or anything like that. <sighs> that was the longest playthrough of any game I have ever done. Yeah, that playthrough was, what, like 50 hours? Damn. It's been a hell of a long time. Well, to be honest, I don't really want to do New Game Plus. I don't think I do. I like the element of discovery and entirely new encounters, but the thought of doing the old encounters, but just with some things changed up and enemies harder, it's not particularly interesting to me. But, thankfully, the first part of the three-part DLC is going to be coming out next month, so there's definitely going to be more Dark Souls 2 very soon. And I'm going to play that as soon as it comes out. I just... I still can't really believe it's over. I've been playing this game for like a month. 50 hours. Damn. Okay, I'm trying to think of whether I'm even going to do like a review on Dark Souls 2 as I do for some uh, for a lot of other games. I don't even know if I can I don't even know what the hell to say about it. I love it, obviously. I'm just trying to think of how to even put that into words. I don't know. We'll see what happens. No promises. But uh, yeah, there we go. So, thank you everyone for coming along with me on this extraordinarily long playthrough. Thank you everyone who gave me tips and helped me out with some of the more obscure things with this game. I'm definitely going to be playing the DLCs as soon as they come out. This game is freaking awesome. Don't think I want to do New Game Plus. Um, if I can go back and do some of the boss fights... Like the dragon fight, which I'm pretty sure is a dragon fight. If I can figure out how to do that without starting a new game plus, if that's even possible, then I might do that. We'll see what happens. But for now, thank you for coming along with me. And I will let you enjoy the credits and the music. Thank you for watching.
Oh. Okay. It puts me back here. Alright, well, first order of business. Look fabulous. Okay, that's uh, half the way there. Let's get all the way there. There we go. Ah, I see. Begin Journey 2 to Drang Lake. So that is New Game Plus, isn't it? Okay, so that means I actually do have free reign to just go around without starting a new game. Which is good. Another reason I don't really want to start a new game is that I've heard that accessing the DLC stuff might be hard to do if you start a new game. Because right now I can go pretty much anywhere, you know? But if you start a new game, I don't think you can. Not entirely sure how it works, but... Yeah. Okay. See if anything has changed here. I don't suppose it automatically reveals the missing bonfires? No. So there's still two bonfires I haven't found. What the hell? One here, and one here. Okay, well, I think I might do some research on them. I guess this uh, playthrough is not so blind anymore, because I've, well, I've finished the game, basically, so... Yeah, I think I will actually research them and figure out what to do, you know? To find some of the content that I've missed. Okay, yeah. So, I'll probably be back. To rediscover that's not rediscover. I haven't even discovered it in the first place. Let's try that again. I'll probably be back to discover that stuff. To go check it out. Huh. Alright. I actually just did some research online. I just looked up a wiki for optional a list of optional bosses. And I also looked up the location of these bonfires. And uh, these two bonfires that I'm missing are actually just simple bonfires that are inside of illusory walls. You know, ones that make it a little bit easier, a little bit quicker to get somewhere. But they're not anything big. There's bonfires and illusory walls, and I think that's it. And as for the list of optional bosses, I don't think I've missed a single boss. I think I've got them all. So, yeah, maybe this is the last video of my playthrough. Apparently that dragon... Uh, the dragon whose memories I went into, I can't fight him. I mean, there's a couple, well... Let's be clear, there's a couple optional bosses that... Well, they're not really bosses, kind of... There's a couple optional NPCs, I guess. I could kill King Vendrick. He, he obviously doesn't attack me unless I attack him. Apparently, if I just keep hacking at his legs, I can eventually piss him off enough that he actually will attack me. And then, of course, there's some NPCs that are particularly interesting to fight. For example, the dragon uh, that gave me the Ashen Mist Heart. I could attempt to kill that, but... I don't know, I don't really consider them optional bosses, because they're, they don't actually attack you unless you attack them. They're just NPCs, basically. So, I don't really want to fight them. And to be honest, the thought of getting up to the dragon, going through all of that again when I could barely get there once, sounds like torture. So, no thanks. So yeah, this might be the last video of this playthrough, so far, you know, until the DLCs and all that, but if I've missed anything, anything significant, you know, anything fairly large, I'm sure there's a bunch of minor stuff I missed, but if I missed anything worthy of coming back and giving it a shot, then let me know. Alright, thank you for watching.